today on how it's automated. Crystal oscillators. A crystal oscillator is an electronic oscillator circuit that uses the mechanical resonance of a vibrating crystal to create an electrical signal with a precise frequency. When a crystal of quartz is properly cut and mounted, it can be made to distort in an electric field by applying a voltage to an electrode near or on the crystal. This property is known as electrostriction or inverse piezoelectricity. Once a quartz crystal is adjusted to a particular frequency, which is affected by the mass of electrodes attached to the crystal, the orientation of the crystal, temperature and other factors, it maintains that frequency with high stability. All fixed production lines are appropriately timed to the nanosecond using these consistent frequencies. To start off, a fixit Pioneer scouts out a usable source of iron. These deposits can be found all across Massage 2, A, B, B in various forms of purity. A miner is placed to begin automating the process. Don't get your hand stuck in there though. Ouchie. Smelters are needed to process the ore into a usable form of iron. In this case, iron ingots. Ingots? Ingots. Ingots. Going with ingots. Yeah. The iron ingots are then processed inside of constructor buildings to turn them into more usable forms still, known as iron plates and screws. Iron plates are. Well they are plates of iron. And screws are. They are just screws. Just. Screws. The screws and plates are then merged to create reinforced iron plates. Iron plates that have been reinforced with more iron plates and have been screwed together. Next, a node containing copper is located to begin the production of cable. Again, Fixit is not responsible for any injuries while on the clock. You cannot be efficient without fingers or a hand. The copper ore is then processed into bars of 99.9% .9 pure copper using smelters once again. The copper ingots are then turned into wire, which is immediately turned into usable cable using a two-step process in sets of constructors. How the cable gets its outer insulation is still a mystery to fix it to this day. Now that the iron and copper products are being made, pioneers will turn their attention to gathering the quartz crystals. Quartz found on cliffs are best for highest quality crystals. I will reiterate once more, you will lose whatever you touch this machine with. Just don't do it, it is a mining machine and will mine your hand as well. Processing quartz is rather simple, only needing constructors to filter out all that isn't quartz. What isn't used is then turned into the containers to hold and ship the quartz. Now that pioneers have built the materials needed to begin construction of crystal oscillators, the reinforced iron plates, cable, and crystal quartz are all flown in by drones to begin the final process. A manufacturer building is all that is needed to turn these three products into crystal oscillators. Another mysterious manufacturing building that shows the same thing being built no matter what actually comes out the other side. In this case, crystal oscillators. That is how crystal oscillators are manufactured using the standard recipe. If pioneers are feeling adventurous, they can use the alternate recipe to manufacture more per minute. Fixit once again reminds you to not touch the minor building. Fixit Incorporated hopes you have enjoyed this tutorial.